so I've been making some iridium. So here's our iridium. I'm going to take what I've made. Hopefully it's enough to make the uh, quantum suit armor. Because I'm a little anxious to face off against these uh, mini bosses from the hermit pack. See exactly how tough these guys are going to be. I'm not sure. I've never really seen them before. I haven't watched any videos or anything like that. So it's going to be uh, new for me. Hopefully it's new for you. Uh, quantum suit armor now. There's a bunch of steps. I think what I might do is... I may just go ahead and make the stuff. If there's anything that seems like weird or anything like that, then I'll go ahead and I'll, I'll jump to that part in the process and I'll show it in the video. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and start making it now. So I guess we should start from the bottom up, which means boots. And here's our Iridium Reinforced Plate, so let's go ahead and do that, I guess, first, right? So we should have some advanced alloy. I might need to make some more because iron plate, bronze plate, and tin plate. Is there's our bronze plate? I hope I there we go. I was gonna say I hope I have some iron plate. Um, okay, let's go ahead and mix these guys together. All right, so our first iridium reinforced plate. Uh, I think I have some diamond in here, but I may be wrong. Diamond, diamond, diamond. I don't see it. I don't know if you guys see it. Let's just order it up from our storage. So, we'll do that. And then I believe it was like show with this guy. And there's our iridium reinforced plate. Yeah, we're going to need more advanced alloy, so shite. Okay, we got rubber. Let's grab some rubbers. And we need some wool. Alright. And we need three boots. Was it three boots? Yes, three boots. So, one. Two, three, one, two, three, and then some wool in the bottom. So those are three boots. What else do we need? We got our two plates. Now we need some crushed lapis and some advanced circuits. Is that reinforced iron? I'm just kind of like making the stuff as I go. Hopefully, I don't run out of things because. That would suck. That would suck big time. Basic circuit. Redstone. How could I forget about the redstone? And I don't have any here. So like, as you can see, like I said before, this is a bit of an involved process. No, that's not what I want. I want the industrial craft. So I don't want seven, I'd rather have two. Boop boop be doo. Let's throw away the wool for now. And we'll go ahead and wishful thinking there. I'll put some of the iridium in the storage. Some lapis. I'm like forgetting all the recipes. Not a good way to start. 
I think this episode is only going to be making the armor because it takes a while. There's our two event circuits. Oh, we need one nano suit boot. I didn't see that actually. I can't remember why I was making the advanced circuits. God damn it. And. Looks like I don't have any crushed lapis. That's. That's weird. That is weird. Unprepared much? Perhaps. Let's throw this in here. Um, and I need some energy crystal. Got six of these bad boys. Let's put the bronze plate back. Ah, I'm gonna have to do it myself. What kind of nonsense is that? One of those. And then this guy and this guy, and there's my Lapotron crystal. I gotta turn one of these boots into a nano suit boot. And I'm gonna need another one of those crystals and some carbon plate. Um, I'll just put a ring in here for now. Because I don't think I'm going to be flying. Alright, nano suit boot. I don't know why it doesn't um, pick that up. It's weird. Oh, I didn't need three rubber boots, is the thing. Okay. Okay. But there's our quantum suit boots. Beautiful. And it's got a little bar down here, so it does take power. So I just want to show you guys that I'm going to be getting power from my uh, wireless charger. And I just want to make sure that it charges while it's on me. Right? Because I know it charges when it's in my inventory. I don't know if it charges when it's on my person. And it doesn't look like it is. So... And it's not charging there either. You know what it is. You know what it is. Because it's a wireless RF charger. Shit balls. Can I stick it in there? No. Okay, so part, this is, we're going to have to, there's got to be a wireless charger. So just in case you guys are wondering, uh, these center lines down the middle, that basically represents when it's getting power. So as soon as I actually configure this cube to send power at the bottom, you're going to see that middle line light up. Just in case you didn't know. So that's output. And there you go, it's filling up. And then if we drop the uh, quantum suit boots in there, it's going to go ahead and charge it for us. So a little bit different than the charge pads. You can actually stand on these guys. Okay, so that's all I'm going to be charging my armor okay I think we're ready to make the quantum suit body armor beautiful let's go ahead and equip that now we're doing good uh, some quantum suit leggings nano suit leggings uh, like that like that and like that. Let's 
go ahead and make some more <clears throat> of these crystals when it's done, I guess. All right, how do we turn these nano suit leggings into quantum suit leggings? We need two basic machines, two iridiums, another one of these guys. I'm going through <clears throat> advanced circuits like you're going to style right now. Okay, now I should be able to do it. And there's our quantum suit leggings. We're moving along pretty quick, guys. <clears throat> um, let's put that away. Put that away as well. So all we have to do is make the helmet. And then I finally have my quantum suit. <clears throat> okay, guys, I think... I think, I think, I think... We can make the quantum suit armor, or not. I need some iridium reinforced plate. <clears throat> and for that, we're gonna need that. And advanced alloy. Yes, yes. Just make 10, why not? Let's just make 10. There is our quantum suit armor, and as you can see, it has the nano suit helm, which has like the night vision goggles, and we got the scuba helmet mixed in there too. So that completes our nano set. Holy crap, guys! It feels like it feels like it's been a long time coming. It feels like we've been working towards this for uh, quite a while now, but. The time has finally come. Let's go upstairs. Alright guys, so everything's charged. We got our full armor. Awesomeness. Um, I can't get this charge pad to work. I'm not too familiar. It should be... Like when I step on it, it should be charging, but it's not. Um, but moving on, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to get rid of the... Uh, ring that I have this guy right here the angel ring because I kind of want to show the armor suit off and the things it can do because uh, Not everyone has an angel ring uh, the quantum suit armor isn't only in this particular mod pad mod pack um, It's in every other mod pack that has the mod The um, industrial craft 2 mod so it's a big like, you know, more more than a couple people are going to run into it anyways. Let's get my sword out. He doesn't even want to fight. He's looking at me. He, he doesn't even want to fight. So as you can hear in the background, that's my... Rocket pack. Part of the mod pack are the armor set. So you get like a rocket pack. And if we go in the water. I thought the scuba helmet came into play. But I guess I was wrong. Let's find out. Let's get into some deep water. And there's our turbines floating around. So it is working. I keep uh, replenishing my air. That's good. There's nothing above me or anything. So <sighs> stupid creeper. Now if I press. There is definitely a button. Okay, so it looks like there is no night vision. But I get like super speed, so I'm the flash now. So that's a little bit quicker. Uh, no fall damage. Let me just get my Hunger back up there.
There we go. And that's pretty much it, guys. I hope you enjoyed the road to the Quantamara because I can tell you that it was definitely a long one. So thanks guys for watching and I'll see you on the next episode. I think we're going to be going after the Hermitcraft uh, bosses on the next one, but uh, I'll see you there. Yeah.